Hello and welcome back to Fable with yours truly Lord of the and the Mad. Hi Lord of Flows, it's Harbour Jeff Spiffening, level 22, boxes Mad and Master Port Sanity, cutest fucking 2013 and all around neutral guy. I don't think I forgot anything. Good. Now, Litchfield Graveyard. It appears it is time to make a prison break. Usually break out of a prison, not into a prison, but I guess I'm helping mom. I mean... On the theory that Solon Cubes and I are the same person, my mommy is apparently a puppy game. If I remember correctly. <laughs> Checkpoint Podcast, go watch it. I think it should be up on YouTube by the time this video goes up. If it isn't, well... That's good. That's that's that would be surprising, really. At least the board is available on Twitch, if nothing else. I was hoping I could still farm XP here. Apparently not. All right, circle of the dead, dead circles, circle deads. Yay! Well, let's see now. There are gravestones here, there's so many gravestones here, I did not read them all. Chimal Pele, a man whose only goal in life was to hang, so he did. Thanos, joining an arm in a far off land, this all that came back. Oh. Benjamin, leader of the board, perish abroad. Ooh, there's a chest there. Charlton of Edwardshire, his legendary sniping skills couldn't keep him from harm. Oh. Kevin, what's left of him is buried here. Here, life robot the crate, kicker of several heads, extraordinaire. Nicholas Rex produced meetings from his bag of tricks. Oh, severed heads, not several heads. <laughs> I needed to check because I had actually misread something in previous episodes as well. Alright, piercing augmentation, that is going to be completely useless to me. Yay. What's this? Rest in B, Stan Smith, killed by the legendary Varsity Troll. What's that? The W. Braham localized on the ground. John didn't even have time to say bye. Man Bell and his friends hope he isn't in hell. You know, John was supposed to die in the end, not right now. Actually, that was Johnny. Casper D engineered his own demise. The Knight Sir Paul, inventor of the Hans Listening Helmet. And Whitehead arrests here, his loud intrusive manner was his downfall. How unexpected. Because I don't get the references if there are any. Ah, an underground chamber. I wish I could take posts on this kind of stuff, but no, no posts for me. At least there won't be any enemies anytime soon, I don't think. Yeah. I will be attacked later there. This is the Kraken mission. It was even the Kraken room. For the Kraken mission. Oh, hello. Be free. You got to be break free or something like that. I got a haircut, I didn't see what it was, I got a haircut. It is probably nothing very impressive. I got a haircut. Wait. I need to get that one. Oh, okay. That also worked. Stop blocking, you bloody buggers. Stop. Oh. But this is the next uh, combat multiplier grinding area. Because I can probably work it up real high again. Really high. Also, I'm going to explode these by just walking near them. Because not enough fucks were given to actually worry about that. There's also a nymph. It's actually in the area now. No. Oh, yes it is. I'm not sure if I killed it or not. 
not. Oh, it's dead. Good. Don't want those annoying bugus to annoy me. What's here? Is it a... Of course it is. And I still haven't sold my other ones. Because I'm a dumb dumb. Alright then. Sure. And let's keep moving then. Come on. Stop that silliness. Stop it. Alright. So let's keep on moving. Also, goddamn, the physical shield is amazing. Really amazing. In case you were unable to tell. This is also pretty good. The one necessary with these enemies. Because they already die from one hit. This one doesn't. It's being so twitchy. Stop being so twitchy. Here. Take that. Yeah, kick some more butts. Let's probably just move on. Because these guys keep respawning. More and more and more and more of these people. These kind, kind people who will die. Because they're undead already, actually. So they cannot die, but still. Who will be removed. Let's go here. Oh right, there's loot here. I know, I know there is loot. Loot there is that I know. I know that there is loot, loot, loot. I need to locate it for loot. What's here? At least I remember this path having loot. It felt important to me that this path had loot, so... I must... that must be why I remember it. This guy is am amazing, yes, but annoying. Come on, fall over. Oh, there's another one. Really, unless I mean to... you know, grind my combat multiplier, there's no reason to fight here. I just go around and... I know, fish. Ah! Back here! There we go. That's more like it. Why is there a flying skull? Never mind. Does it even matter? Oh, right, this is the alternative path, the one from the starting area. Where I could go from underneath the stuff. And as I remember, there is actually more loot. Not particularly used to loot, but... But loot. Oh, it just fell over again. Which is really annoying, because I cannot strike what's on the ground. So you can just swing around rapidly, at least there is no stamina system or anything like that in this game. Otherwise that would really be terrible. Alright, sharpening augmentation. And a lot of undead. You could say it's an undead horde. Yes, quite. Alright. There's some more here. I really like Berserk. It's really good. Yeah, okay. I think there was also some sort of treasure that way. Like this chest here. Treasure? Oh, fuck. Ah. <laughs> I won't even worry about that. Oh. Now they want to fight, eh? Well, a fight is what they get. Well. As soon as they actually stand up, they're going to get a fight. If they keep lying down, I can't fight them. Bastards. Oh. 
Oh no, you don't. Oh, gods. Well, I kind of do. They'll be on. Get out of my face so I can chop off your head. Wait. Get in my face so I can, you know, kill you more easily. Because I don't use uh, ranged weapons while you do. And I still find it funny when he kicks an enemy that is already dead. You know, just falling over. The boss that is decapitated, yet still getting his ass kicked. That's amazing. Loot! These guys actually know how to do damage. Which isn't entirely problematic, but it's not fun. Health potion, health potion. Loot potion. Wait, no. God damn it! Yeah, that is a loot potion for me. I should sell them because there's a cap. God damn it. I don't know why they got them. Ooh, loot. Because priorities. I hope you are all very happy to see me because I will or will not kill you. How much is Jack pay paying you, eh? Is it worth it? Is it worth dying for? I guess it must be. It's, it's kind of dead. How'd you get down here? What the? It's very easy, really. I kind of fought some undead guys and then persuaded another undead guy to let me into some area. We're undead guys. We're undead. And guys. Yeah. That's the story. That's how I got here. And I'm getting dark leather and dark chainmail equipment from this uh, adventure. Which would not be an issue if I actually wanted those items, but I don't really. I guess I really don't. And an obsidian katana. My katana is probably better, but and I'm using a different sword than that. Wait. Actually, is that inventory inventory weapons? Melee weapons? Ah, yeah. The Harbinger does more damage than... Wait. No. No, it doesn't. The Katana here you is better than the Harbinger. Might as well switch back to the hammer then. Do some hammer time. Hello, Bobby Game. I mean, Mom. Again, and I'll wring your neck. Wait, I know you. No, it's a trick. You're not my son. The bastard's playing with my head. But it, it really is you, isn't it? What the hell were you thinking coming here? Don't you see you'll take us both? Never mind. We've got to get out of here. Get this damn cage open. Alrighty then. This is actually not going to be this easy. Oh no, you don't. Unless I misremember. It's not far now, but we must hurry. What the hell? Get him! When did these reinforcements arrive down here? Hmm. Was it really this easy? Did they return to the prison for some other reason? Later? Because I remember spending a while in the prison. Oh yeah, here we go. Jack. Oh. It isn't polite. 
tried to leave without saying goodbye. Bastard! This child of yours is quite the hero, dear Scarlet. Did you know he's being crowned Arena Channel? He would have been so proud of him. He must run in the family. That and getting locked up in one of my charming little cells. You disgusting freak. Let him go. He doesn't know anything. Oh, I think you'll find he knows a great deal. You see, the arena seal I gave him has been showing me his every movement. It has been most entertaining. Digging up graves, saving old fools, meeting with their crazy sisters. Yes, it appears your darling little daughter is alive too. She's told him all about the sword and that wretched bloodline of yours. And now, my sweet, you're going to tell me where the key is. Can't it just berserk and kill them all? Just get yourself nice and comfortable there. My we'll beard! Be to get you and the other scum later. They stole then my beard. We'll have a bit of fun. You Enjoy stole it, my natives. beard. Go to hell, pig. Stole temper, me. Tibbs, temper. They stole my you beard. You should keep all that energy for later. You'll need it then. <laughs> oh, and don't try any of that funny Will stuff. It won't work in here. The boss made sure of that. I want my beard back. Give it back. Give it back. Hey, you. Yeah, me. Cell next year. I guess you're the one they've been hot pokering all this time. <laughs> I could hear you squealing all the way down here, mate. Nothing to be ashamed of. They know their pain here. Wait a minute. I know who you are. You're that avatar, aren't you? Beat the arena and let the big prize go to save pretty little Whisper, didn't you? Hmm, oh, we don't get your kind in here often. What'd you do? Kill a mare? Slice up some pigs? Bet the warden can't believe his damn luck. It's his birthday today, you know. The vicious bastard. Every year. He has us dragged out of our cells, shows us a little sunshine, so we know what we're missing. Had a lovely drink. And sticks us back in. Doesn't do it out of the kindness of his heart, either. They race us round the courtyard, and take bets on who'll win. Then the winner gets a trip to the warden's office and... Well, what goes on in there is too cruel to mention. Still, at least you get a good look at his place. And there's more than books and furniture in there. I didn't even do anything wrong. Those guards deserve to be gutted. Oh well. I'm ready for the race. Look lively, scum. Time to move out. It's race time. And you'd better put on a good show. Some of us have bet a lot of money on you. Win, and we like you. Lose, and you get a round oh. in the torture chamber. That sounds fun. Yes, sounds fun. <laughs> Let me hear it. Right, you miserable sods. I want to see a dirty race. Plenty of pushing and shoving. You hear me? Get into positions. Three, two, one. Go. You're not going to win this time. <laughs> I don't remember where the track goes. You ugly maggot. I burned it this way. Faster, faster. Hmm, good. I think I might have an advantage here. Get your finger out, puss bag. All right, so I think I've backed this race already. Yeah, useless filth. So that's nothing to worry about. That way, yeah, useless filth. I should break Keep all the barrels in the way, but I'll be able to do that Keep later. Scum. Next episode, even. Get your finger out, puss bag. 
Yeah. Get a move on, you ugly maggot. You ready? Bravo. We have a winner. Guards, escort him to my office. Welcome to my modest quarters. You have earned yourself a singular reward. One of my world-famous poetry readings. Yes, that's right. These stone walls cannot still the beating heart of a poet. I don't want to hear one sound from you. Pouring forth one's soul requires the utmost concentration. The recital will begin anon. Remember, I require total silence. <laughs> Alright then, thanks for watching guys, see you next time.